Oh, it's a very sad day as this is the last day we're going to be with Yannick and Michelle. Um, Lisa and I are going to part ways because they, they've got longer time here in New Zealand and I'm leaving for Asia in a couple of weeks. So Lisa and I are going to travel the North Island together and we're going to be getting around by hitchhiking. So we're going to hitchhike the next couple of weeks and make our way up to Auckland. This is our last uh, morning together, we're all eating bananas. Um, but yeah, we're about to leave in about an hour, so we'll be hit to the end of the morning. So goodbye to you, Yannick. Our hostel here in Wellington. Our next stop is um, Panganui, which is on the west coast of the North Island. It's just Lisa and I. We're trying to hitchhike there. It takes about two and a half hours, but it's 10:25 now. We're going to see how long it takes for us to get a ride. Yeah. Yeah. We finally got a ride with uh, Bruce. He's just taking us down a bit further to the motorway, where we'll have a better chance of getting a ride up to Wanganui and then all of a sudden we got hit by this Honda on the motorway. It's scary. <laughs> so he's just getting her details now. Hopefully there's not much damage to the car. But at least we've got a ride and we're on the way. Hopefully we can get another ride from another kind person. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so Lisa and I are now in Johnsonville, which is just outside of Wellington. It took about 25 minutes in the end to get picked up, so that was all good in the end. Thank you, Bruce. It's a bit of a car accident on the way, but we seem to be okay. Um, so Johnsonville is just outside of Wellington, about 15 minutes drive. But from here, it should be a lot easier to get to Panganui because it's right by the motorway, and more people are going to be heading that way. So hopefully, we'll be in Panganui by the afternoon. We're now in um, near Palmerston, it's about the halfway point between Wellington and Whanganui. Thank you to Sean, another local who's taken us this far. And yeah, it only took us five minutes to be picked up by him, so thank you very much. Coming up to an hour now, we've been waiting here in Levin. No luck, hopefully. We get something. My arm's aching. I'm holding my arm out. Oh, we finally made it to Funganui. Took about just over five hours, all in all, all the hitchhiking trips we did. Thanks to everyone who gave us a ride, especially the last guy. I didn't actually catch his name, but he just seemed to be high on life. He was a uh, very nice. He took us all the way here. So cool. We just uh, settled into our hostel now. It seems more like a hotel. Very good buddy. Just another thing, we know hitchhiking is dangerous, but there are two of us and we have a system for if we ever think a car is dodgy or if we don't trust whoever is going to pick us up, so we're going to stay safe on our journey of the North Island. <laughs> Hello. 
So we've just booked our hostel for tomorrow. We're going to be staying for two nights in a place called National Park Village, which is north from here. So we're hoping to hitchhike from Banganui, which is where we are now, up to the National Park, which is where we're going to do the Tongariro Crossing. One of the great walks in New Zealand and the best day walk you can do. And we've heard great things about it, so we're looking forward to doing that. So we've finished with our time here in uh, Whanganui. It's been more of a kind of stop off, but time to get kind of our plans organised for the North Island and for me for af afterwards for when I go to Asia. Now our next stop is Tongariro, which is um, where the Tongariro crossing is. It's an awesome scenery, it's where the mountain from Lord of the Rings is, Mount Doom. And uh, it's not the best day for hitchhiking because it's pouring down. But hopefully we get lucky and we don't get too wet and get a ride to National Park which is about an hour and a half away by car. We waited an hour at um, Whanganui. We got picked up by an awesome couple who um, had loads to tell us. They done a lot of hiking. They dropped us off. Well, they took us to, the, to our hostel in the National Park Village. We dropped off our um, stuff there, and then they've taken us all the way up here to where the chateau is, Tongariro Chateau, and we can do a, like a hike here and find out some information because we'll be doing the Tongariro circuit tomorrow and they were telling us some awesome things like their son is a um, professional cyclist he was in the um, Commonwealth Games something Arch Matt Archibald or something and also they were saying about how they were they, were, they lived in Christchurch and they were um, they experienced the earthquake and we did the Richardson walk and we're now heading back to our hostel in National Park Village we're going to try and hitchhike back We've just arrived in Picton which is where we're going to be getting the ferry tomorrow to the North Island 